Alright, so this is interesting. So we have Trev has Meow Scarada, uh, Annihilate, Chien Pao, Daspun, uh, King Gambit, and Golden Ghost. So looking at this, Gar funny enough, Garganacle does look pretty good, decent. I think the one thing I need to be mindful of is that Meow Scarada. Um, I don't naturally have uh, bug type moves. I do have flying, and I, I could use Golden Ghost's Choice Card to help out too. There's also Furgraph, and Furgraph does have, like, uh, I think what Furgraph has that's nice is the, uh, uh Dazzling Gleam with Terry, uh, Fairy Terra. That could help. Chien Pao has Fire Terra. I have Grass Terra and Dreadnought, so that can, that can help me get away with a few things. I could do that. I'll lead with... Dreadnought and Pelipper just to put an immediate offensive uh, pressure, and then I'll bring in Garganacle and Golden Go in the back. Um, yeah, I think that the oh, dude, no need to apologize. Oh, by the way, how'd your PC gear go? Hope that you're you're feeling better afterwards. Um, but yeah, I think that if I had to change up this team a little bit, I might not go with the rain mode as hard as I am now. Um, and yeah, the Water Terra on Garganacle is kind of nice, but there's definitely some conflicts that exist with that too. So, uh, I'll have to, I, I think we're going to revisit choosing Water Terra there. Alright, yeah, it looks like my video keeps on freezing. The gameplay is fine, but the video itself, there's a little bit of slowness to it, which is something. Okay, so Meow Scarada, Chi, and Pal lead. How do I want to deal with this? Now, Meow Scarada, I probably could knock out one t turn with Ice Spinner, which would be helpful. Um, I don't know if I need to tear immediately. And then how do I want to deal with... Okay, so I think I'll, I'll just split my damage for now. So I'll use Hurricane, and use Ice Spinner on Meow Scarada. Okay, so I, naturally... Yeah, I don't blame you. It's definitely a time to game there. So, luckily, Meow Scarada wasn't choice scarf to, uh, choice, uh, focus fast or anything, so we got lucky there. Uh, we had to deal with the Sacred Sword, but we'll take that. Honestly, that, I'm very happy with how that played out. And we get the confusion on top of that, too. Man, I am mean. I, let me tell you. Alright, let me see how to fix my camera a little bit, because I know, yeah, uh, a couple of y'all called out it. It lagged a little bit. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and... Deactivate the uh, webcam for now, and I'll reactivate it in a second. Okay, so it is reactivated. Alright, so it looks like a little bit better there. Let's try that. Okay, so we have King Gambit. Uh, King Gambit probably is going to Sucker Punch. So I'm going to take this opportunity to use Tailwind. And then I will... I will Liquidation there, King Gambit. Oh, they decided not to... Sucker Punch, be mean, let Smurks come out to play. Yeah, <laughs> I could. Uh, oh, and the King Gambit actually wasn't... Uh... Alright, so we're going to have to deal with the High School Crash. We take that decently well. I'll follow up this Tailwind, uh, so that means I get an outspeed going forward. And then King Gambit just uses Brick Break. Alright. Totally fine by me. All right, we'll bring in Golden Go. All right, and let's double check of the field state. So, Steel Terra could potentially work. I think I need to be mindful of Annihilate. So, I don't want to just commit it immediately. Uh, let me go ahead and Hurricane Chi and Pal, and then I will go ahead and just use make it rain on both. If I if okay, Chi and Pal does snap out of confusion. Sucker Punch, yeah. That was the one thing I should have had a better counter for. Uh, yeah. Now that I think about it, I should have just tear it. Because this is pretty easy. King Cambridge is going to use Kowtow Cleave. And I get knocked out, right? Yeah. Um, thinking through that trick could have worked as well. And I think that would have been a better slot, uh, a choice here. So, we're going to bring in Garganacle. Now, nice thing is, Garganacle is pretty bulky. So, we can use that to our advantage. And then, Dash Bun is the last Pokemon. Okay. So, here, I would like to Water Terra. 
I will salt here and I will fire it off on King Gambit. And then really it's just like, can we serve, can we be bulky enough to deal with Dash Bun? I think that we can beat Dash Bun. But man, I think I was a little bit too sloppy. I should have respected Sucker Punch and I did not respect that at all. Okay, well, Playoff doesn't do too much there. I actually outsped uh, King Gambit, so... But yeah, I'm pretty sure Brick Break, right? Yeah, Brick Break, okay. Alright, well, we take that like a champ. So that's good. I am actually curious why they chose Bass Bun in this matchup, in particular. Um, but knocking out King Gambit's good. And then we get to Salt Cure Dash Bun, and then we'll go from there. And then it's Protect, Recover, and you basically just want to stay as bulky as possible. Because Dash Bun, I don't think, has a natural way to boost up his defenses. Okay, Dash Bun is actually going to Terra. Terra Fairy would make the most sense here. Yeah, to get the most kick out of your play rough. Okay. Yeah, I respect that. Yeah, I could see that. Yeah, that's a great call out. Crunch is interesting. Um, I guess they were try worried about missing with play rough. Um, but yeah, I can definitely see that's a great call out, Apollo. Maybe they felt more confident with Dash Bun with against the opposing um, Chi and Pao. Right, and so that might be why they chose it. Um, but Crunch didn't do much even with that crit, which is nice. And then Dash Bun is going to take some Salt Cure damage. Tailwind is over, but didn't make a difference. Uh, and then there was no uh, leftovers. So we get to go ahead and fire off this Protect. I can definitely... Yeah, I think that might be a good call. Maybe against the Chiam Pao. Yeah, the opponent's going for crunches just so they don't miss. Uh, which actually works too for our favor. Because um, without Play Rough... Because Play Rough miss, yeah, but you do more damage overall. Uh, which is what hurts the most. So yeah, I'm just whittling away a Dash Bun, and I'll be able to win this. I, I'm confident I can win this 1v1. Here, if I get crit, then I get my HP back. So yeah, that's the thing about Gargonite Hole. It's like, yeah, there it is. See, that's the play rough. So uh, it could be a flinch or a lower defense. I can I definitely see that. Where it was trying to lower my defense before it got that play rough in. So luckily with that Protect, though, or with the Recover, I'm getting all my HP back, right? So I get a... I'm pretty comfortable here. I get to kind of... The turns are a little bit in my favor, but I am playing against crits. I'm playing against uh, defense drops, things like that. So we just got to be careful here. So. But luckily too, and that's why I'm maximizing my uh, leftover recovery. So yeah, there's play rough again. And we just got it. We gotta just slowly versus early wait till Salt Cure is done. Uh, Daspawn could also have like a Pinch Berry. It doesn't seem like it does, but it could. All right, so here's another play rough. Oh yeah, the uh, max special defense, max HP. It's a fun build. It's really good. Um, but yeah, play rough isn't even a two hit KO, so I think we'll be okay here. Okay, we play it safe. What do we want to do? I think I can salt here and then protect. Even with the crit, we should survive. Ooh, double edge! It did, didn't do anything. I'm so sorry. Uh, sorry about this. I, I literally salt cured you again. And that was enough for a knockout. But yeah, I was just trying to accelerate the battle a little bit. Is there a base stat total cap for these? That's a great question. From a base stat total cap, there is none. Uh, it's just what Pokemon are available. So you can play any Pokemon except for Maridon, Coridon, and the Pokemon that are not in the Paldean Index, like Typhlosion. Um, but yeah, uh, it's mainly just EV training. And then it doesn't matter what level they are, they all get set to level 50, regardless of what level. So even a level 1 will get to 50. Yes, I do too. Yeah, great job. I appreciate that opponent for trying their best. Uh, I think that the play rough strategy was what they were trying to do. Crunch to try to get defense drops and then play rough was the right way to play it, right? And so, um, yeah, shout out to my opponent. They did a great job of trying to 